everyone so in this video we will guide you how you can define team permission on transact so first you need to go to all modules now in all modules you will get an option of settings click on settings now once you will go to settings please check here is the team option click on this now once you will click on team you need to go to three dots here you will get the option of permission this permission option will only be displayed to the management user so be sure that you are added in the management team while making changes in the permission click on permission now this is the permission window here you can go ahead and define the permission as per basic level moderate level and full basic means just the basic access view access or i may say go ahead and just check the documents moderate means you can go ahead and modify the documents edit the documents create the documents full access means entire operation action here you can edit save save and send and make other changes as well now the permission are defined in such a way that the very first is related to the sales documentation purchase documentation where you will get all the options this is the all documents which will help you in this getting uh, checking the documents now uh, in the report you can go ahead and segregate it through sales invoice purchase invoice so these are the sales related uh, reports this is the purchase related reports if the permission is not provided they may not be able to go ahead and access the sales related reports so here as you can see for the purchase team sales reports are disabled so they may not be able to go ahead and just check the sales report same uh, there is the accounts inventory now going below there are further permission as well related to the settings inventory production accounting integration business intelligence here is the document access scope which where from where you can define that this particular permission will be user level or the company level if user level is selected suppose they are creating the document only they will be able to see that other person other team members will not be able to see that neither they will be able to see any another team members document this is mainly used in the sales here you can go ahead and just hide the confidential data like process item id process item description enable white listing enable store wise permission so these are some of the functionality which you can use in our team permission i hope this particular video will be helpful to you while managing the team permission have a good day ahead